Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. Here is an update regarding the first round of Amazon ML challenge which is machine learning round. And in this round we already know that we have to submit a solution for the given problem statement. And let's see what is a problem statement and more detail about the first round of this challenge. So before getting into them, uh, join in my telegram channel. Telegram community where I'll post the uh, updates on internships and job opportunities. So stay updated and join now. I'll have provided the link in the description. And also follow me on Insta for latest updates. So let's get into this uh, the first round of this challenge. So you will get this interface uh, as a machine learning the first round is live and we know that we have to submit the problem statement uh, in the given time they given the three days of time and in these three days of time we have to submit the solution for the given problem statement so here you can see the code button and when you uh, click on this button you will get this interface so this is whatever the key instructions are given and uh, there are many key instructions and uh, for this the first round of this challenge and only the one problem statement is given. So here you can see this is a window from the uh, we can see we can submit the uh, a solution to the problem statement from the 13th of September to the 15th of September and uh, you can uh, submit this uh, solution of uh, uh, maximum of 15 submissions are taken within these three days. So uh, once you have completed the 15 submissions, then the submit button will be disabled. And you can also the teams are uh, only the team leader is able to take participate in this challenge and uh, the teams can track their performance uh, through the uh, leaderboard. So uh, we can also check your leaderboard for this challenge. And then next about the uh, so we already know that we have to submit a one to two page document where we will explain about the ML models and experiments and the conclusion and ML approach and we will also use some source code uh, that is used for the experiments and training and everything you have to mention it proper along with the comments and the functions. So based on all these factors they will give the marks and you can see that in the leaderboard so uh, each team can make the maximum of 15 submissions over the three days of this hackathon and once the 15 submissions are completed then you cannot see the submit button so this is about the uh, so top uh, 10 uh, 50 teams will be and uh, the results will be announced on the 18th september and they will take the top 50 teams and then for top 10 teams uh, they will give, uh, there will be a virtual grand final on 24th of september so the disclaimer is also given uh, so for this uh, amazon ml challenge event so uh, we request you to uh, refrain from the using publicly or the commercially available large language models whatever the APIs are there such as uh, Microsoft, Fa Facebook or Google so that submissions where you are using the open AI and other AI companies then it will be the uh, LLM uh, APIs will be discarded so uh, you will get this interface after this you have to uh, uh, type here start and click on the start then so uh, other instructions are also given so if you have any doubts, you can also mail them. So you will get this interface once you click on the once you type and start. So this is a problem statement given. So it is a feature of extraction from the images. That a description is also given and output format is given. And file descriptions are also given. So those are the source files, data files and constraints. So here you can see the leaderboard. Uh, when you click on the leaderboard, uh, you can see your team and your ranking uh, among all other submissions. So here you have to upload the submission file uh, that should be in the form of CSV format. I know, I hope you all know about the CSV format. If you don't know, please let me know in the comment section. Uh, that should, uh, the file should be in the form of CSV and 
here uh, whatever the source code is there nothing but the code is there so and whatever the you are explaining about the your source code or whatever the description is there so that you have to compress in the zip format and you have to upload the file here so once you have uploaded both of the files then you this button will be activated submit and evaluate so you can click there now again next time whenever you want to do the changes so again you upload the both files and again click on submit and evaluate so like this you can up uh, you can take up to 15 submissions uh, within this three days so in if you want to in one time itself you can complete but uh, you can also check the letter board based on the letter board submit the files so that you will be getting more points so once your 15 submissions are completed the submit button will be deactivated and you cannot submit more files anymore so this is about this little bit and after the constraints uh, evaluation criteria is also given so for this total problem statement you have to uh, make the solution the submission uh, the submission file you have to upload like this uh, like dot csv file and then the uh, down data set is also then participant resource is given you can check it the, you can check that and when we talk about the guidelines the guidelines are the same so you can uh, access this from the day one to the day three and you can check the uh, performance in the leaderboard so uh, checking the performance in leaderboard is a must and should because so uh, final uh, uh, till day three you have to check your uh, performance and uh, make sure that you are in the top 50 members because every time the for every 15 minutes the leader will, board will be changing so if you have any uh, queries you can also uh, click on this link and you can uh, submit your queries there so they will select the they will select the solution based on all these uh, categories like uh, models which have used and experiments and what uh, whether your code is relevant or not whether you are using proper comments or not and whether you are describing the functions uh, uh, whether your code contains of unnecessary data so everything they will be checking so make sure that your code is in a proper way and they can so that they can understand it very clearly so it should be very neat and clean and whatever you have to mention the source code that is compulsorily for the experiments and uh, make sure that you do not complete all the 15 submissions in the one day so make sure that you leave some submissions till the day three so that if you are in not in the leaderboard then you can do some changes in your files and then you can upload it again so that you will be in the top top 50s and as already i said to that uh, only the team leader will be able to participate in this the team members cannot participate but you can take the help of your team members so if you cannot take uh, take in the mobile device you can only take either in the desktop or the laptop and if you uh, uh, always simultaneously log uh, in other desktops or the laptops then uh, it will be uh, as it it will be a uh, very proctored uh, and the next uh, so you can attempt only assessment only in one laptop and you cannot always log in in other desktop or other laptops so in such cases if you do uh, if you simultaneously log in on other devices then they will terminate the assessment so this is all about and if you have any technical problem you can mail them uh, to the unstop or you can just uh, give your query to this link. So this is all about the machine learning round. This is the first round of the uh, Amazon ML challenge and if you have any doubts please let me know in the comment section and also join in our communities for more updates regarding internships and job, uh, job opportunities. So this is all about the Amazon ML challenge and uh, uh, thank you so much.